Hello and welcome to the first episode of a new series. So I had about five episodes of my last series and I had this opportunity to start a new series. Um, what happened was we went and joined a new server called Zoby, Z-A-O-B-Y. Had a great time over here. And within about two days of us joining, well actually it was about a week of us joining the server and building some bases, uh, they reset the server, they created a new world. And everyone could bring over one base from the old world to the new world. And this is it. So we are now in a new world here. Uh, Tab and I have been here for a few days. And we've got started. So this is Tab's little tree base where we're hiding out at the moment. But as you just saw there, this is going to be our new base. It's going to be the new home of the Wooter Boots on this server. Um, as you can see, it's a sky base. It's absolutely gigantic. And to be honest with you, I regret the design decision already. The design was to have a series of intersecting rings which look a bit like something from the original Stargate when uh, uh, the, the, the ship comes in and teleports someone out. You have these interlocking rings that come down. And to be honest with you, it's a real, real pain to build them. A real pain. Um, this is going to be a powered stair. So we've got red redstone here and they're going to actually be powered rails all the way up here to get up very quickly. But until then you have to hop all the way up, which is a bit of a pain. And that chains that leg. Just let me go collect that egg. It is the very end of the server. The server was built on Good Friday and it is now Monday evening. So we are all quite poor in this server, really. So give me my cursor. And yeah, no, this is the bone base. This, you know, this is Dan Sand Tab's place from the Woot Boots. And as you see here, we're currently living out of just the offside the base. So if I take you up to the base in just a second. Okay, here we are at the top of the base. So you can see down there, that was Tab's little base just down there. This is the staircase up. As you see, I haven't quite finished building uh, the rings, and that's because we ran out of glass. We had to go do a ton of glass mines for that. Uh, up at the top here, we are currently doing a couple of quick marms. Over the left here, we actually have a gold farm already on the server. The first thing I build is a gold farm, and that is we give me a constant source of gold to build things like powered rails so you can get around quickly. See, so everyone's just logging on for the evening at this point. Uh, the gold farm is a simple design. It's got three very large nether portals on this side, and then we're expanding it right now. What we're actually doing, the very thing we're doing right now is expanding it onto this side because everything has to be symmetrical. If it's not symmetrical, it doesn't exist on my base, uh, which is going to be a bit difficult when we start building some insymmetrical things, but what we have to do is balance them out. Let's see, zombie pigman, come on, zombie pigman, come on, come on, walk off the edge, walk off the edge. Oh, he's a bit dazed, he's just been spawned into this world, he doesn't know what he's doing. And he's going to walk off the edge any moment now. Come on. Uh, a bit of a, a weird design, I know, because you might go, why not just build all seven on one side? And it is all about symmetry. Come on. Come on. Last time I built these all one block lower, which meant you could just punch them. And you can't quite punch them here. And I just fell in the water, which isn't good. Ah, there's one. And they're, caught, they're falling onto the edge. I'm going to have to rethink this design. Um... Maybe you have to build this up another block because that guy over there has just walked onto the edge, which he's not supposed to be able to do. See, I've still got a stone sword. This is how early in the game we are. Punching. Oh, there he is. He's fallen down. And he goes to the middle. Bye bye. Ah, to his death. The events are we're going to try and build the other half of the zombie pigman spawner over here. We're going to change the access. So instead of having this cobblestone, this ugly cobblestone pillar there, there'll be a different access, probably at the this side, the south side, which will also lead to a mob spawner up there. The mob spawner allows us to spawn some villagers, or rather zombie villagers, which will uh, heal to give us villagers, which we'll use to spawn the actual, what we're hoping to build, an iron farm out here. We won't be building an iron titan in, in this world because we're not in the spawn chunk. Uh, there are a couple of other designs I want to try out, but all that's to come in future episodes. This base here, this is actually where the train tracks lead up to. So the train will come up here, the train track will come up here. Some kind of station, probably a bit of cactus or something there for it to land on. And then we will have some other bits and pieces uh, to sort of go into maybe a mass storage area for all these farms to feed into, as well as this farm. And that's about it for today. I am also keeping a diary of what's going on, a text diary, and I'll put a link to that in the description below. But that is all for now, and, and hopefully I'll see you back here in a later episode.